Time now for ABC4 News Sports with Dana Green. It's early signing day in college football. BYU, Utah, and Utah State all trying to bring in as much talent as possible and keep the local stars at home as well. But the biggest local prize got away. Corner Canyon quarterback Jackson Dart announced on ESPN that he's going to USC. I'm excited to announce that I'm committed to the University of Southern California. <laughs> Dart, who set a state record with 67 touchdown passes this season, chose the Trojans over BYU, UCLA, and Arizona State. I love their winning culture and the tradition that they have, and I'm super excited to play an offense that spins the rock, and uh, yeah, can't wait to get after it. BYU did land eight local recruits, half of its class on early signing day, including a couple of Timfew stars, defensive back Raider Damuni and linebacker Logan Fano, who both committed years ago to the Cougars. BYU also inked Lone Peak defensive end John Henry Daly, as well as Bingham wide receiver Isaiah Glasker, who will play defensive back at BYU. Maple Mountain wide receiver Kyson Hall joins his brother, quarterback Jaron Hall, on the Cougar team. Kalani Satake says he likes the size and speed of this class. These young men fit our program perfectly, and, um, and what we're trying to get done here as far as adding depth, um, adding some speed and some uh, some strength. Uh, you're looking at the, the, the length that we have in this group too. I think gives us a lot of potential for a lot of big time player playmakers. Utah signed a couple of new local players, including Bingham defensive end Viliami Bua, but the top prize is four-star California quarterback Peter Castelli. The Utes were in on Castelli early, and the dual threat QB will enroll at Utah in time for spring ball and is expected to be the quarterback of the future. Ricky Parks, a four-star running back from Florida, will come in and compete for playing time right away. He and Ty Jordan should provide a lethal combination in the backfield. New Utah State head coach Blake Anderson is solidifying his recruiting class. Three local return missionaries are back at Utah State, including East High's Johnson Hansen and Weber High product Sione Moa. Also, Aggies leading rusher Jalen Warren, who left the team this season, is transferring to Oklahoma State. Kearns High star Jeff Bassa is off to Oregon, as is corner canyon lineman Jackson Light. 